Warple started forward, picks it up outside of the boot, chips it inside 50. Bruce, plenty of time to spare, normally uses it well. How good is Luke Bruce in front of goal? Yaff is off and running down the wing. Davies Uniac came at him to make him kick it. Front spot, almost. Menager's mark, Wingard from the pocket, pokes it and pokes it straight. Too straight for Hawthorne and he's taken out the cameraman in the process. Atley told to go. Inside to Hall. He was there for the one-two, but it was ignored. Mackay. Thomas instead. Down the spine he runs. The Tasmanian. Couple of bounces. And blasts it. Goal square. Goldie in the goal square. And kicks the goal. The ex-Tiger pops it down the line. Young, the target for him. Juff at full stretch. Taron Thomas the other way. And let's hope Juff is okay. Taron Thomas also holding his right ribs there. So big collision with CJ. As we see CJ just coming from the ground now. Lazaro had to jump from four deep. Marnie protected, but Scrimshaw went and got the Sharon. And his spear pass to Wingard in the pocket. Delightful. And he's already kicked one from here. Well, this one's not as tough as the last one he kicked. He's got more time to think about it. That's a delight. Brilliant start from the Hawks. Horrific news for Hawthorne and Jouth if can't take any further part in the game. Morrison, clever. Shields a little fumbled and hacks it off the deck and the chaos ball might work again. Wingard slick because it's Gear outside of the boot. Another one. And now Phillips might need some treatment. Cousins got it up to Shields. Again, wobbles one. Tries to use the corridor and it works. Wingard, who's been hotter than hot, looks for a chest to pass to and lace out with a ribbon on it to Kaczynski. I would like the Leapers to be encouraged, Kingy, so you're okay. asking the wrong guy. Yeah. To half forward, Wingard goes up this time. Lewis got his arms free to Wingard, who's everywhere, floats it to the pocket, Shields. Well, he gave it a thought, the play on. Keeps it low. One of the toughest tasks in football. Hawthorne in long system. Play on, said the umpire, no. Holding the ball free. Tarrant Thomas to Hall, who puts the Jets on from half back. Shrugs Cousins, has a bounce. He might go all the way home. Pulls it late, and that'll work. Marnie pulls it late, <laughs> and that'll work through? to Taylor Garner. How did he get that through? It's... Nice from Hall to Dumont to Atley. Off and running. Had the inside handball to Powell. He in turn finds Taylor Garner. Is he within range here, Taylor Garner? He thinks not. Heads to Larky, who had to dive to collect it. Frosty the go man, straight through them. Gave it up to Wingard. Back to Frosty. Looks up, options are plenty. Moore's out wide. He can send it inside 50 or go for home. Loops the handball over the top. The shrug. Mitchell to Moore. Awesome from the Hawks. Oh, short inside kick. Scrimshaw was always under the hammer. Marnie caught, slung into the deck. Taylor Garner, one against the grave for North, and they're on the way back again. Campbell to do the ruck work. Palms it down, throat down the throat of Cunnington to Dumont to the hot spot. Marnie with the Marnie kick. It's a two goal game. Chips it to the leading players. Up flies Terran Thomas. Boots been lost in the process. Davy Juniak shrugs Scrimshaw and drives it home. North Melbourne hot right now. McAvoy nearly parked. God, he's got it anyway. And gave it up to Zerha. Magic moment for North. It's a one point game. Could he have a big last quarter? Oh, Inside oh. kick is, well, it looked terrific for a second. O'Meara left it behind. 
Paul mopped it up, gave it to Simpkin. Huge opening, heads long, Zerha got it. Saw their team bust out to a 32 point lead. But North Melbourne have stolen the lead back again. Cunnington, Simpkin, Hall get some distance on it and it's out of it and a free kick to Zerha from North Melbourne to come back can they finish the job though Zerha struck it beautifully and the Hawks are on the ropes Campbell with the reach Simpkin with the slick hands Impey waiting in the hole shrugs it and pushes off and darts off with a bounce beautiful movement hands it to Wingard he slips on the kick, but it works! He just uh, recharged the batteries. There's a bit of an arm wrestle here at the moment, as you said, Kingy, and then a little burst from the, the Stars. Moore caught high, gets a chance to give Hawthorne back the lead. He looks up, he goes to Scrimshaw from the arc. He's got plenty on it. Just enough on it. Hawthorne back in front. O'Brien and Goldstein. Goldie. Gets on the end of it and drives a goal square. But a couple of boys, that's high. Who's free, is it? So Taylor Garner. And North Melbourne fans, the North Melbourne players know this is their big chance to win their first game of the season. And they're back in front with 10 minutes left. From the flick down. Phillips dives in, gave it to Harwick, scrambles it away, he'd be playing in front, but he couldn't juggle it. Taron Thomas had to be the Tasmanian at home, could be the hero, not by two goals. He could go for home, sits it up, top of the goal square, massive moment, Kaczynski pounced back onto it, gave it to Omira, he fed it on, Bruce, there's a kick in it, with 1.50 left. The footy gods have done it again. David Noble, on his 54th birthday, a Tasmanian back in his old home state. And the drought is broken. North, their first victory of 2021. And David Noble, his first victory as an AFL coach.